Keith, my oh. name is Ajit, and I, I'm a, a club level player here, and I, uh, be, I play three or four times a week, Okay. and I compete in a lot of the local tournaments, um, and I, I do fairly well, mm -hmm. but what I found is, um, you know, when it comes to winning the cru crucial games, there are, uh, there are um, rallies in which I have the opponent pinned in the back, but somehow I'm not able to finish it. And I, I believe it's my smash. I don't have that killer smash that's going to okay. give me that point to win that crucial point, crucial point in the game. I've lost two finals as a result of that, and it's frustrating. You know, I've tried a bunch of rackets. You know, I've tried a head light racket. I've tried a head heavy racket. Um, you know, and this one in particular, I just went to the local pro shop. And they told me that I need to get a head heavy racket. This one in particular is going to help me. Um, what do you think? You know, will a head heavy racket help me improve my? I smash? believe that's an Astrox ninety nine. Yes, it is. Okay. Yes, a head heavy racket will definitely help you with a better and a stronger smash because it's more heavy and it'll transfer more power onto the shuttle when you contact when you hit a smash. But what won't it have? Uh, you know. Uh, Will, it, will I have trouble moving the racket through the air? It's, it's, it's pretty simple. It's pretty simple. So the weight of the racket, mm -hmm. when you swing the racket, it transfers the weight of the racket onto the shuttle. So a head heavy racket would naturally transfer more power onto the shuttle. That makes sense. And the headlight racket would transfer a little less power onto the shuttle. But the swinging speed of a head heavy racket is likely to be slower than a headlight racket. For a good smash in your uh, personal point of uh, context, you would want the shuttle to be traveling at a steeper angle for which you gotta hit the shuttle at an optimal point. So your technique, your swing speed, your point of contact, everything comes into play. Mm -hmm. And most of us have this problem. We wanna hit hard, but we're mistiming it. We're not getting the best shot. Most of us, most of us out there have faced it and we've been there. Thing is, when you start off with a head light or an evenly balanced racket, you're most likely, it's more easier for you to fix your technique, get the swing right, get the point of contact, get a perfect shot. Yes, you might have a little less power, but you might still get a perfect good smash. And once you master that, and once you get comfortable with that, you can slowly start using a head heavy racket or a heavier racket. And now that will help you generate or put more power onto the shuttle at the same point of contact. The, are you, do you understand what I'm but saying? How do yes. I transition from using a light, a, a, a light head light racket onto a head, head heavy? This racket. is what I usually uh, suggest most of the beginners or the intermediates. I, I get asked the same question more often, mm -hmm. especially from the beginners or the intermediate or the parents. Ideally, it's much, much better to start off with a headlight or a evenly balanced racket. So your technique gets better, your skills get better, your swing speed, your swing shots are all corrected and better. You'll even have better quality of shots like your clears, your drives, your lifts. And slowly during that period, you can always use the head heavy racket in short bursts of training to get the feeling to take the advantage of the power in the head heavy racket. Yeah, that makes sense because interestingly, the, the yeah. expert, uh, the, the coach of the local club says. But ideally for anyone who's starting off, a lighter racket or a well-balanced racket is most suitable. It'll help you fix your technique, get the timing, get the swing, get the optimal point of contact for a best steep smash. All right. And then you could switch to a heavier racket where you can do the same and have more power put onto it. And there you go. You'll have a good smash. Thank you, Sankey. I'm going to no sign problem. up for the next tournament right away. Awesome. Thank you.